We begin with developing news. The Washington State Patrol says a vehicle collision brought down a power pole and telephone and fiber optic cables. Apple Valley News Now's Alyssa Warner, my colleague, joining us live in Sunnyside along I-82. Alyssa, what can you tell us? Hi, Austin. We It usually takes about 50 minutes to get to Sunnyside. We are in stopped standstill traffic right now. Nobody is getting through on either direction on I-82. So this power line came down at about milepost 68. You can see up ahead of us there is a traffic sign that is for exit 67. Nobody is getting off there. A lot of GPS I think are rerouting people off at exit 73 if you're coming from the Tri-Cities towards Yakima. That was where ours tried to divert us but since we actually wanted to get to this scene and show you what's going on we of course didn't follow that direction. If you are trying to get from east to west tonight I would suggest that you follow a GPS even if you know where you're going because this traffic we've been here for probably 20 minutes and nothing is moving. It's an absolute standstill. You can see pictures from state patrol show that power lines have dipped down low enough, not power lines, but as you said, phone and fiber optic lines have dipped down low enough that you actually can't drive under them. So we're working to get more information ex about exactly what happened here, but I can tell you from just observation, as you saw, traffic is not moving on I-82 near Sunnyside, so please take a different route if you need to get anywhere in this region tonight. Austin, we're going to get some more information. I'm going to send it back to you in the studio. Alyssa Warder live for us. Thank you, Alyssa.